Rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So the stage we are, uh, where we are um, of the of the salati, you know, our my prayer. Uh, after we sit down, after the second, like in the second raka, after we are done with sujood, we sit down and we start reading what is in the box right now, in the big box. At-tahiyyatu lillahi wassalawatu wattayyibatu Assalamu alayka ayyuhan nabiyyu wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh wa barakatuhu At-tahiyyatu I will not go into detail as I went into it yesterday I will just go with the meaning we settled on and we can come up with some variations of it if you prefer all the expressions of praise are for Allah and all the prayers and all the charities. They're all for Allah. Peace be upon you, O Prophet. And from Prophet means Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Peace be upon you, O Prophet. And mercy of Allah and his blessings. His blessings. This is a plural word. So that's where we stopped yesterday. Inshallah, we will move on today to the next part. Assalamu. You see, it's the same Assalamu which is here. And it is the same Assalamu which we use in like Assalamu Alaikum. So Assalamu Alaikum means Peace be upon you all. Alaykum, right? Instead of alaykum, the only variation is it is alayna, right? So instead of assalamu alaykum, it is assalamu alayna. So peace be upon us. Alayhi, alayhim, alayka, alaykum, alayya, alayna. Peace be upon us. Wa. And ala. Allah means, uh, please keep your uh, mic mute and only uh, unmuted when you are asked to participate, inshallah. Allah, Allah means upon. It's the same Allah which is here, upon us, but it is, uh, uh, the meat is attached to it. But over here, it is not attached. So Allah, upon, Ibad. What is ibad? Ibad is a plural word of abd. Like we have names like Abdullah, Abdul Rahman. Abd means slave or a servant. So Abdullah means slave or servant of Allah, slave of Allah, servant of Allah. Abdul Rahman means slave or servant of Rahman. Rahman is a is again a name of Allah. So Allah ibad upon slaves, Allah, Allah, as-salihin. As-salihin means, it's a plural of salih. You see, uh, today we learned ism fa'il, like fa'il, fa'iluna, fa'ilina. So similarly, salih, salihuna, salihina. So this is the second plural. Of Islam file. The first word will be Salaha. And from if we carry that word, then we will make Islam file from it. Saleh, the one who is pious, the one who is good. Salihuna, Salihina. So those who are pious, those who are good. Sulaju. In Urdu we say. Peace be upon us and upon the slaves of Allah, the righteous. So in other words, we can say, peace be upon us and upon righteous slaves of Allah. Good slaves of Allah. Okay. We have to put an off between Ibad and Allah. Hmm? Slaves of Allah. So instead of Abdullah, it is Ibadillah. Abdullah means slave of Allah. Ibadillah, slaves of Allah. So just a plural. 
ashhadu an la ilaha illallah wa ashhadu anna muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluhu now this word ashhadu we can actually make this word so first word will be in the in this is a this is a verb right so the first word word will be shahida and i once i do the tpi in front of you inshallah you will understand automatically what it means shahida means he witnessed shahida is the first word it means he witnessed shahida shahidu shahidta shahidtum shahidtu shahidna yashhadu yashhaduna maybe i should turn my uh, video on so shahida shahida means he witnessed shahida shahidu shahidta shahidtum shahidtu shahidna yashhadu yashhaduna tashhadu tashhaduna ashhadu 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 means i witness this is mudare second last word mudare and then nashhadu ashhadu and then nashhadu ashhadu i witness or i bear witness an this vocabulary is very important like word an this vocabulary will in quran in come in quran so many times an means that i bear witness that la not ilaha ilaha means worthy of worship deity in 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 for for easiness we can say god god illa except don't mix ala and illa i see some people mix it up and they get confusing uh, they are confused ala means upon and this is illa illa means except except allah allah i bear witness that there is there is no word for there is but to have a continuity in english i have to add this i bear witness that there is no god except allah i bear witness that there is no god except allah wa and ashhadu see is it's a shame ashhadu there is no difference so ashhadu means i bear witness and tpi should help us reach this word and understand what it means ashhadu i bear witness anna 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 means that so an means that anna means also that there is small difference but we will not go into that at this time anna means that muhammadan muhammad this is a name name of our prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam abduhu so abd as i already talked about abd abd means slave or servant you see it was ibad here so ibad is a plural and abd is a singular so both words are here abduhu his slave abduhum their slave abduka your slave abdukum slave of you all abdi my slave abduna our slave so abduhu his slave wa and rasuluhu rasul means messenger and this is again we have done this rasuluhu his messenger rasuluhum their messenger rasuluka your messenger rasulukum messenger of you all rasuli my messenger rasuluna our messenger so rasuluhu his messenger and i bear witness that Muhammad is his slave and his messenger who is from meant by his here Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and i bear witness that Muhammad is his slave and his servant we are all slaves of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so let's go back from where i started peace I just read Arabic first. Assalamu alayna wa ala ibadillahi salihin. Peace be upon us and 
upon the righteous slaves of Allah. Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah. I bear witness that there is no god except Allah. Wa ashhadu anna Muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluh. And I bear witness that Muhammad is his slave and his messenger. So I will stop here. If there are any questions, uh, we can talk about them now. Any questions? Can we use this lam lam na petrol jins? Absolutely no God. Yeah, yeah. So brother uh, Naim is is telling us, and he's right. There is there is a very strong negation here. This la is a special la. Hmm? Uh, the the people who had who has done this course before, they are aware of. It's even name. I don't have to mention the name, but just trust us now that it means there is absolutely no God. This lie is a very strong la. It la. It it very strongly negates it. I bear witness that there is absolutely no God. That's the right translation, the correct translation. There is no word for absolutely. There is no word. which could be translated into the english word absolutely but this is just the arrangement and the way these words look i bear witness that there is absolutely no god except allah and i bear witness that muhammad is his slave and his messenger any other point any other comment questions concerns brother shabaz just when we go abada So abid, abidun, abidin, right? That's the plu, plu, plural. Ibad is another word for abidun, abidin. No, 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 no. 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 Okay. No. This is like ism file, ism of all. They are uh, derived isms, hmm? and there are isms which are not derived. Abd means slave, yeah. right? And ibad means slaves. Okay. And abid means the one who worships. Oh, it's different. I know the root letters are the same and everything looks the same, but there is slight difference here. Okay. Jazakallah. Right. Can I have a question about ibadillahi salihin? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Uh, Slaves of Allah, the righteous one, because there is a mudaf mudaf. We can we translate Salihin first because it is not so far masu. Okay, how you want to translate it? Like uh, slaves of Allah, the righteous one. Yeah, you can do that. There's no problem with that. Tell me why it is Salihina, not Salih Salihuna. Because this is mudaf la. No, no, no. I'm asking why it is Salihina and not Salihuna. Because this is a majroor, should be majroor. Why? Allah should be majroor. So Alihina is not mudafil, eh? Because this is a majroor, no? No, it is majroor because ibad is. Ibadi is majroor. Yeah, ibad is ibad Allahi is mausuf and so Alihina is sifa. Anyway, I we just I said a few things. The new students don't need to worry about them. Okay. No worries. You will know all of this, inshallah, in due time. Okay. If there are no other questions, we can move to the breakout rooms now. Okay. Jazakallah khairan, brother Shahbaz.